<laughs> Hello. How are you guys today? Oh, man. <laughs> Let's breathe right away. Maybe even do some ohms. And just let all this wild energy go, right? It's a lot happening. All right. Take a sip of your water. Maybe extra today. <laughs> Big breath. Oh, yes. Thank God. Let's do some ohms. I'm I'm feeling it. I got my little mala here like screaming at me. She's like, let's do this. <laughs> We're not doing the whole thing, but to just start one more breath. Notice the peace. No matter what's going on around you. Breathe in that space around you. Breathe it in, breathe it out. Notice how there's always plenty of air for you to breathe. <clears throat> and notice that there's more than enough. And how that relaxes you. You may feel your shoulders drop. Let's do another one. Breathe in deep. your hands like this um, there's a notch down here you can kind of hook like part of your thumb in like it's like this perfect spot right and it's a little hard to get your hands together but you do the best you can you kind of have to pull your shoulders back and you kind of just kind of press into that area It's a little uncomfortable at first, but you can feel this connection. It's like you can connect to that. It's like the heart chakra and the solar plexus chakra, right? All in one. 
and it creates this like powerhouse of energy <clears throat> and just <clears throat> circles around and kind of feeds itself it feels amazing it's so energetic so we're gonna do one more ohm ready take a deep deep breath clear your throat let it fall out of you For a moment, you can rest your hands maybe on your lap. Just rest now. Breathe gently. Feel your feet connecting with the ground. You may need a sip of your tea or your drink. Just be comfortable. Be in your own personal space. Think about how far does that extend out for you? What feels comfortable? Maybe look around you. Where does your toroidal field reach out to? As we can, I believe, suppress it and keep it very close to us. Which isn't necessary. I think it's fun to stretch it out. Take a little more space, maybe. How does that feel? Because in that field you have that vortex in the middle, and then it goes out around you, and then it comes back underneath. Just think about how far out yours goes. Feel it. And this is your energetic source here, that heart, solar plexus, chakras. That's your powerhouse. You can touch those areas, feel them, right? Connect with them, feel that energy. Or you can do this, it's a little... Hard to do, but you can do it. Breathe it in. Feel those feet grounding you. If we're not grounded, we get lost. We seem to get stuck in the mind. But if we're grounded to Mother Gaia, oh, she feeds us. She sends us these beautiful energies. And 
think she's sending them anyway, but if you don't notice them and you can't feel them, you know, I think it works better if we can just really connect and intentionally connect with the earth. It feels like it just floods in. And if you feel like there's a lot of thoughts, just go back to that heart space. Stay in that heart space. So that's a quiet space. And everything seems to fall away. Those things that were so important that you needed to say, you don't even remember what they were. Once you're really in that hard space. You realize that that stillness is all that's important. You want to stay here. and live this life that you're in right now today. A lot of us don't ever live here. We're future tripping our whole lives, running to something that maybe isn't there or it's not there yet. And maybe something else is gonna be put in its place that you didn't expect. Yes, it's good to visualize, but you need to release it to the universe so the universe can work on it for you. And whenever you hear someone hammering in the distance or sawing or even jackhammers, remember this is a reflection of the universe working on your future. Sometimes it's crazy, right? There's jackhammers. It's a madhouse. <laughs> wow, what wonderment is being worked on. And it could be. So what if all that hard work was for everything to stay the way it is. <laughs> That's the mind blower sometimes. Wow. Maybe it needs to be the way it is for now. Because you need a little more time. And that's fine. It's good. We can only go at our own pace. Breathe. <sighs> Release your arms if you're holding them. I'm going to ask the great central sun to send us a message today. Really feeling that, our connection, that great source beyond our own planetary sun. In that ultimate dimension, whatever that one is, is it 12, is it higher? I've been hearing, go to 12, go to 12 lately which is taking me aback a bit. But why don't we play there? Why not? I was in the 12th dimension. Would I worry about what I was worrying about last? Hmm. Probably not. just sort of releases everything, gives you a moment to breathe, 
to release all that anxiety. Don't be afraid of that word either. It's just a word. We're going to ask this great central sun, send us a message from whatever dimension it's in, knowing <clears throat> that it can connect with us at any time, and especially if we ask. I ask it to come in. Send us a message through that planetary sun portal. And when those rays of light hit us, no matter how soft a light you're in, the next time you go outside and that light hits your body, Remember to open yourself for that message. And maybe we get a little hint, even now, of what's being said to us. <clears throat> just take a big, deep breath. And just think about that beautiful sun. Great central sun with all its magnificent power. All its beautiful love. Sending out waves in our direction. Feel the waves, see the waves. Feel that quietness, gentility. Just like the waves wash up on the beach, they turn into that beautiful foam and they just sort of float forward. Maybe you'd like to send the sun a message too. Feel free to do that now. Not sure what to say. Just tell it I thank you. I love you. And I'm open to receive from you all that great light. Feel yourself opening to receive. I can feel like opening an old creaky door. It's a little stuck, but you can get it open. Pull it open and let that light shine in. Feel it on your face. Feel that solar wind come. Close you back just a bit. You step forward for more. Mm. Let it ignite a 
that great shamanic rainbow light inside of you. As you are a light body. And you are connected. to that great central sun. Feel it wash over you. Feel yourself magnetically drawn to the light. As you are the light, that's what you know. Maybe you'd like to travel through that planetary sun portal. Go to a little orbit around that great central sun. Maybe even give it a, a big hug and rest. For a moment there. How does that feel? You feel cared for and loved unconditionally. Mm. You deserve all the love that can be given. There's no stopping this love. It's always there for you. Put some of that love, my great central sun, into your heart chakra. Scoop it up. Put it in there. You're going to bring it home with you. My big sun for this visit. Now we're going to venture back now through that portal of our planetary sun and back where you're sitting now. Sit for a moment. Get ourselves regrounded and absorb in that gift we received. See a big, giant, glowing rose. I think that's for all of us today. If you see anything, please let me know. Make a little comment. I'd love to see. Take a deep cleansing breath. Feel it to those feet as you blow it out. Feel stable, complete, and whole. Look up. Look around the room. Back. Great job. Like we had that extra special 
session today. Namaste and please come back and see us again soon.